What's up guys, today we're going to be talking about the newest release from Wendy's, which is a ghost pepper chicken sandwich. If you haven't heard about it, you're about to hear about it. I tend to be like a ghostbuster chasing down all these new products that come out by these restaurants. They're with fast food chains. They tend to be releasing a lot of spicy items. The Arby's Diablo sandwich we tried, the 1921 ghost pepper slider from White Castle. We ended up doing the Popeye's ghost pepper wings. We even went after the yellow bird fries that were released a couple, what, weeks ago or last month? So now we're going to give this bad boy a try. If you haven't seen those videos, I'll leave a links down below in the comment section. You go check them out. What we've got is this gnarly looking thing. Take a photo for the thumbnail. And what it comes with, ghost pepper American cheese. Has actually some ghost pepper ranch. We have some ghost pepper seasoning on these onion crisps, which you can see right here. And even comes with spicy chicken and some lettuce. So everything that we've tried so far that's been from the fast food chains hasn't been really disappointing. I mean, some of them does pack some heat and then again, some of them doesn't. So we're gonna give this bad boy a go and see what the thoughts are. It is messy. So for my thoughts, it's got some great flavor. Definitely has some nice kick with it. Like the ghost pepper cheese definitely bumps it up a notch. The ghost pepper ranch definitely helps as well. The burn tends to linger. I would definitely go after this again. Let's give it another bite. He's messing for sure. Shit, this got me sweating. So we even went ahead and got the ghost pepper fries that came along with the meal. So the ghost pepper fries tends to have an oil on them like the garlic fries. There you go. Well, you can't really tell from the photo, I guess it's a reflection of the sun that they're oily, but let's give them a go. I love Wendy's fries. They're nice and crispy. Sometimes they're a little bit soggy. For fries, I'm not really a big fan of. They're oily, they do pack some heat, but I mean, the oil makes the fries soggy. Look how limp it is. The sandwich, I'll definitely rate that my go-to a lot better than the fries. I like that a lot more. Flavor-wise, heat-wise. So we'll go back to finishing this bad boy. So I'd have to say this one's this sandwich will be my favorite out of all the fast food restaurants that I've tried so far this year that have been introduced to something with ghost pepper or something spicy. The flavor on this one's pretty good. The heat is well-rounded. And all in all, it's just a great sandwich. French fries, I am not a fan of. I mean, they're oil-based and it just makes the French fries soggy and oily. But it is what it is. You can't win them all. Yeah, I'm going to finish my lunch and get back to doing, uh, doing what I was doing earlier. I'm Hot Sauce Mike. Thanks for tuning in. Today we talked about the ghost pepper chicken sandwich from Wendy's. Till next time, guys. Later.